heading for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their wish. Fans the world over are fully focused on this atmospheric stadium where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? Find out with us on EA TV. A warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Brentford up against Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. A oh, good hit, close shave. The line-up then for the hosts. Well, in this 5-3-2, the three central midfield players will need to work hard today. They've got to make forward runs, cover the wide areas, and be the creative spark. They'll be key today. A oh, tremendous vision. Oh, showing good patience. Diogo Dallo. The lineup for Manchester United. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Neil Mopé. Reguilon. Now he must fail on the cross. Now they couldn't take advantage of the position they were in. Rashford unable to hold it. Hello to Mike Stewart and wife Eileen, who are celebrating the wedding anniversary. Christian Nurgard. Mike and Eileen. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. And the textbook interception. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Well-timed tackle. And quick thinking defensively. Lindelof. Rashford. Well, it's a long way off target, you've got to say. Well, that's not great, is it? There's been a real lack of quality in the game. The passing's been too safe, and there hasn't been enough movement from the front players. The recipe for a poor spectacle. Lindelof. Bruno Fernandes has it. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. He's in with a chance. And there it is. The opening goal. 1-0. And they'll feel they deserve it. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. And with that, the first half draws to a close. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency.
Nice ball to switch the point of attack. Oh, big chance. And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, Eric Ten Hag looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side has been really good today. So, back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Ben Mee. Reguilon. Vitali Janelt. Christopher Ayer. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. And play halted, free kick given. Managed to get it out of there. Now, maybe room here for the counter attack. All hands on deck. So, a half an hour remaining. Christopher Ayer. Collins. Roerslev. Can they create something from here? And space to cross it. Opportunity here. Corner coming up. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Well, opting for the short corner. And a goal it is! But offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. What can he do with it now? And options in the centre. Really good, strong tackle. And it'll be a throw-in. Well, there it is. United haven't had as much of the ball. But their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. Diogo Dallo. United could be onto something. That's a useful cross. Just the clearance that was needed. Can they hit on the break? Firing it towards goal. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And there it is now, a substitution. Delivering it. It's not a particularly good corner there. Third. Quite possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. And a long way out here. It was an accurate free kick, but a fine save. And successfully cut out. Mope. Oh, what an opportunity. And how about that for a save? And the problem not completely solved. Well, they can bring it out now. Promising possession, this. And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing!
Beijing just can't stop him today. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. And there it is, the final whistle. A result to please Manchester United fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today.